Hi, this is Mato. In this video, I will show you the game between Karol Romatka and Zygbert Taras. This very beautiful chess game was played in Slovakia in 1922. Karel Romatka had white pieces and he started at e4. Zygbert Taras played c5, Sicilian defense. Knight to f3, e6, d4. C takes on d4, knight takes on d4, a6, and Hromatka played c4, going for Marozzi bind variation of the Sicilian defense. Knight to f6, attacking the pawn on e4, defending, queen to c7, bishop to e2, and Taras played d6. Bishop to b4 have been played quite often, but it may not be better than the move played in the game d6, white to move, Karel Hromatka castled kingside, bishop to e7, bishop to e3, bishop to d7, rook to c1, and Tarash castled kingside too, king to h1, intending f4, rook to c8, f4, knight to c6, queen to e1, white queen is heading for g3, knight takes knight on d4, bishop takes knight, e5 blocking the bishop but giving away the control of d5 square, bishop to e3, queen to d8, another way to go was bishop to c6, then perhaps knight to d5, bishop takes knight, c takes on d5, queen to d7, f takes on e5, d takes on e5, bishop to d3, and white is slightly better. In the game we have a queen to d8, f takes on e5, d takes on e5, a queen to g3, and white is now much better. Can you see why? White, dark square bishop, maybe coming to h6. White can sacrifice the exchange on f6 at the right time. And white knight on c3 is ready to jump to d5 at the right time. Bishop to e6. Rook from c to d1 attacking the queen. Queen to e8. Now white can capture the pawn on e5. But Romatka played better move, bishop to h6, threatening a checkmate. If queen takes on e5, then bishop takes on c4. So we have bishop to h6, threatening a checkmate. Queen to f8, defending the pawn. If g6, then queen takes on e5, and bishop takes on c4 doesn't work, because of rook takes knight. So we have a queen to f8, knight to d5, bishop takes knight, e takes on d5, king to h8, threatening pawn takes bishop, bishop to c1, bishop to c5, queen to h4. Black position is very difficult to play. Knight to d7, bishop to d3, threatening Queen takes on h7, check, mate. h6, queen to h5, knight to f6, attacking the queen. What is the best square for the white queen? What would you do? Please pause the video and find the best move for white. Did you pause? What did you find? Did you know that Romatka was provoking knight to f6 when he played queen to h5? He provoked this move in order to sacrifice the exchange. Pawn takes rook. Bishop takes on h6, attacking the queen. Queen to d8. If a queen goes to g8, defending the pawn on f7, then bishop to f8, discovered check and attack, queen to h7, queen takes queen, check, mate. Tarash 
played queen to d8 and resigned at the same time in view of this continuation. Queen takes on f7, threatening checkmate. And if now queen to g8, queen takes on f6, check. And after queen to g7, queen takes queen, check, mate. And let's go back to this killer move. Did you find the killer move in this position? If you did, congratulations. And that is all. I hope that you enjoyed watching this video. I wish you good luck with your chess and bye for now.